Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're going to talk about the best vegan food in London. So for those of you that don't know, my family are all from England and each time that we kind of take a trip back to see family, we also tag on a little vacation on the end of it, just me and my husband, and we hit up a lot of the vegan places in London. So I thought I would share a few of them with you today. So some of these are purely vegan restaurants, some are restaurants that cater to vegans and vegetarians, and some cater to all diets. So there's something for everybody in London. So here we are, in no particular order, here are my recommended best vegan places to eat in London. Little disclaimer, this should be so far because we haven't hit all of the vegan establishments in London and new places come and go all the time. So, little disclaimer. So by far, my favorite place that we went to on our trip in September was called Rudy's Dirty Vegan Kitchen. This is not the place to go to if you're looking for a healthy salad or want to stay on your diet. Seriously, I cannot rave enough about this place. Camden is the place to go to for vegans in London. There's so much choice and this place should be at the top of your list. The milkshakes are to die for. So good. So next up on our list is either Temple of Satan or Temple of Camden. They have a couple of locations in London. They're called Temple of something, but they're all based around Satan, the wheat meat, and again, just phenomenal food. My favorite was the chicken. They had little kind of chicken bite ball things, and I have never been to KFC. Yes, I've been vegan that long but I've never been to a KFC, and this is what I imagine KFC tastes like. Um, it is just amazing. Really reasonably priced, and just fantastic. It's definitely somewhere to hit up, and we will definitely be going again next year. If you are on the west side of London, a little bit west of um, like the V&A and the Natural History Museum, I highly recommend checking out 222 Vegan Cuisine. We found this place a couple of years ago. It is amazing. Um, I can only attest to their lunchtime buffet, which is just delicious. It's real food, it's all vegan, and the lunchtime buffet is all you can eat. What more could you want, right? Just vegan food on demand, it's perfect. They do do desserts, desserts are extra, and I highly, highly, highly recommend their chocolate cake. Mwah. If you are looking to go somewhere with a bunch of non-vegans, then maybe check out a Green King pub. So we checked out a couple of the Green King pubs, and there's quite a few kind of dotted all around London, but they do a couple of vegan options, and one of her favorites of the whole trip was the mushroom and ale pie. Definitely, definitely worth checking out. And plus, the non-vegans can just eat whatever they want. So quick intermission, if you like what you see here, please consider giving me a thumbs up. And don't forget that I have a Patreon page, so there's a link in the description to that. It takes a lot of time to edit and do these videos, and I would appreciate your support. No worries, if you can't, I just want to try and make this an ad-free channel. Alright, back to the video. So as I said, Camden is probably like the vegan mecca of London and another place in Camden is called What the Pitta. Really great vegan donna kebabs, like just mind blowing. Who knew that you could get a vegan donna kebab? Absolutely worth checking out and again, just amazing food. So our next option is gonna be Wagamama's. Now I've chosen Wagamama's because we've had a few visits here and it's great to go if you're dining out with a group of non-vegans. They've got meat, they've got fish, they've got vegan options and everything is clearly marked on the menu. And we've tried quite a few of their dishes and all of them have been fantastic. They're really good as well because the weather in England can get a little bit chilly and their, their bowls are just great at kind of warming you up and you're just good to go. You can head out and do the next thing that you're going to do on your sightseeing trip. On our most recent trip, we found a new place called Mushi's. So quite often you either get like full-on vegan health food where it's kind of salads and just vegetables, or you've got total junk food. And for me, Mushi's falls somewhere in the middle. It's kind of 
healthy junk food, I guess. Um, so it's made from more wholesome foods, think more veggie burgers rather than fakeness. And who doesn't love sweet potato fries? And if you're looking for a delicious treat and something a little bit new, then definitely check out the vegan mozzarella sticks. Any vegan or vegetarian knows that one of the best places to go for your vegan food is an Indian restaurant. And in London, you have Govinda's. Govinda's is a Hare Krishna restaurant and it is a karma-free kitchen. They have vegan tali that is great and really well priced. So if you love vegan Indian food, then Govinda's is really worth checking out. So one place that we found on our trip last year that we kind of went back to this year was a place called Mildred's. They've got a couple of locations in London and the food is really, really good. It's real food and you can obviously get burgers and all of this, but they also do bowls, they do salads, they do all kinds of different dishes. They also do really good desserts and they have a really nice atmosphere in their restaurant so definitely worth checking out. Another new place that we tried out this year on our trip was a place called Purizza that is a vegan pizzeria. And again, it's another one that's in Camden. They're all in Camden, man! If you're going to this place, I would recommend booking a table or be prepared to wait because it is super freaking busy. There's all kinds of vegan pizza, lasagnas, there's cannolis, there's just everything. So if you are in the mood for some Italian cuisine, this is the place to go. However, if you are looking for Italian cuisine and you're going with some non-vegans that are insisting on eating non-vegan, then I would maybe suggest checking out Zizi's. Zizi's is an Italian restaurant that has a lot of vegan options. We actually had our anniversary dinner there last year and it was really, really good. They have vegan starters, vegan pizzas, vegan mains, vegan desserts, everything. Anything that you could want here, you can probably get, as long as it's Italian. Now when you think of London and England, you might be thinking of afternoon tea. And you can get the vegan version in London. So there's a place called Cafe 41. It is a little bit north of Hyde Park and it does a vegan afternoon tea. You'll get the traditional little finger sandwiches, scones, including vegan cream. You'll get some little desserts, tea and a glass of bubbly. Definitely the traditional English experience with a vegan twist. For those wondering, there is a vegan pub in London. I've heard rumours that there's another one further south, but I haven't been to that one yet, so I cannot vouch for it. But the Coach and Horses, we have been to, and yeah, it was good. On our trip this year, the kitchen was under construction so we couldn't um, obviously eat there, but on our previous visits, we've had the vegan fish and chips and it was great. So if you're looking for the experience of eating at a London pub that dates back to the 1930s, but you still want your vegan food, then check out the Coach and Horses. All right guys, that was my list of the best vegan foods in London so far. Um, but obviously places change. There's also a couple of things that I've left out because those are no longer um, in business. So let me know what you think in the comments. Leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!